Hello everyone, greetings from Kharkov, Ukraine. My name is Svetlana Mucha and I'm the leading matchmaker and dating coach at Dela.com. Today I would like to answer two really cute and I believe important questions that we have received from our dear subscribers at our YouTube channel. The first question is why are we actually doing international matchmaking? Why not local? And the second one do we hate Ukrainian men? Let me start with the second one. No, guys, we don't hate Ukrainian men. We actually love them. And Ukrainian guys, uh, they actually are really cool. And if you are lucky to meet a great Ukrainian gentleman, if you are lucky to marry a good uh, traditional Ukrainian gentleman, you would be really lucky. Ukrainian men, they are traditional. Uh, they are know our culture, they understand that Ukrainian ladies love being behind the man, which means uh, that uh, all the important decision and all the hard decision usually are taken in the family by the gentlemen. Usually they are supportive, they are romantic, and many of them uh, love this model when the gentleman, for example, is working and providing for the family, and the lady stays at home and takes care of kids, uh, her job is turning uh, house into actually home. It is a total myth that all Ukrainian men drink uh, vodka all day long, play balalaika and fight bears. That's not so. We have plenty of wonderful Ukrainian guys in Ukraine. The problem is that the number of wonderful Ukrainian ladies exceeds the number of wonderful Ukrainian guys. Of course, like in every nation, they are not so decent people, um, so I'm sure there are some not very nice American gentlemen, there are some not very nice Ukrainian gentlemen, not very nice Russian gentlemen, etc. Like in every country, you have different people. But why international dating? Some of our subscribers have claimed that we are doing international dating because we hate Ukrainian guys. That was never the reason. How could you jump into such a conclusion? That's a little bit insane, but well, uh, now we have been inspired to film this video. So thank you very much for inspiration. So why international dating? Trust me, I have been uh, asked this question not only by our subscribers and sometimes by our clients, but every time I go to the professional matchmaking conference to New York or to London or to Köln, Germany, uh, my colleagues, professional cupids, they ask me like, why don't you do local? Why bother with international? Like, that's so hard. Like, people speak different languages. They are from different time zones. How do you make them travel to meet the matches? Like, matchmakers in New York tell me that they have a problem that people from Manhattan don't want to go and date uh, to the other area of New York. Like, how can you make singles travel half the globe to meet someone like how can you do that to answer your question international dating is very specific and i always tell that all my clients both male and female they are super romantic just think about it the whole idea that you have to cross the ocean half europe to fly for 12 hours to meet someone to meet your potential soulmate it's like super romantic so you have to be like extremely romantic to be considering international dating and to fly over to meet someone also look at it from the female perspective a lady is expecting a gentleman from another country and he has spent like 7 12 sometimes 20 hours in the air to fly over and to meet her like isn't that romantic like that's crazy but that's crazy romantic so international dating is for very specific type of people for those people who believe that they want to have that special extra something in their relationship that they want to set this uh, romantic base for their relationship from the very beginning that they want to uh, add uh, something unusual uh, something out of the box to their relationship. With international dating you can choose the best from each culture and bring it to your relationship, to your marriage. You can mix the traditions and usually our clients they look at their differences at, as a positive thing, not at the negativity. Because sometimes um, while c conducting the first interview with a potential client, a gentleman tells me like, oh but how am I going to communicate with her, like her English is like uh, not 100% good, like she's not a native speaker and she knows nothing about our traditions. With such a mindset, uh, with such an attitude, probably you won't succeed. Because usually people who succeed at international dating, they have different attitude. They think that 
wow, we can teach each other so much, we can learn so much from each other, we can combine our traditions and create new traditions inside the new family, we can teach each other different languages. And also, I believe that international couples have the cutest babies, especially if they are not only international, but from different uh, races, uh, they are like so beautiful. I love international, interracial babies, they are the best. And from the very beginning, usually they speak two languages. Isn't that a great bonus? Uh, not so long ago, uh, I had a dinner with a couple. We have introduced them last year and uh, at the beginning of 2018. And in December of 2018, they got engaged. So this year in 2018, they will got married. And uh, this couple, uh, uh, they are very exotic, really a beautiful couple, and uh, they were sharing like uh, the experience. Uh, they have moved in together after they have got engaged. The lady has uh, moved to the country of the gentleman to get ready to the wedding and to get, uh, to meet everyone to get used to his new life. So everything works well for them. And they told me that uh, it is so exciting, for example, uh, they teach each other how to cook uh, national cuisine from, of his country and of your country. And also they have uh, doubled all the holidays per year. So now they celebrate like two Christmases and also other religious holidays. They have doubled them all and uh, they teach each other every day the language of each other. So they play like a teacher and a student and, and they love that. And uh, they love uh, all uh, the uh, novelties that each of them is bringing to this relationship. This is why they both wanted international uh, dating, international relationship on the first hand, because they wanted to have a special something in their relationship, uh, because they wanted to uh, spy them up, uh, add romance, of course, international dating is not for everyone. Uh, once, uh, many years ago, we have been working with a gentleman and he went out with one of the ladies um, we have introduced him to and he told me that, oh, she has a strong Russian accent. Well, yes, because she is Russian speaking, she is from Ukraine. So, like, are you surprised? And he's like, Mm, I don't find it appealing. Guys, if you don't find accents appealing, then probably international dating is not something you should consider. Like if you want to date someone who speaks pure English uh, with Texas accent or I don't know, with um, Virginia accent, if they have an accent there, uh, then you should date locally. International dating is for a very specific, very niche type of people who really want to uh, learn more about new cultures, who really want to get to know their partner from all the sides and who are ready to accept their partner with all the differences and who actually sees these differences as a huge plus, as a huge bonus. So why do we do international dating? Why do we do international matchmaking? Not because we hate Ukrainian guys. Uh, we do local matchmaking as well and we have a separate base of ladies uh, who are willing to date only locally and we introduce them to local guys. Of course, our main focus is international dating and international matchmaking. We do international matchmaking because we are so passionate about other countries, other nationalities, about love and romance. And we love it, uh, we love watching how people combine, for example, Ukrainian culture and the culture of Germany, or Ukrainian culture and the culture of China. It's so interesting to watch such couples. It was never the reason to, like, help Ukrainian ladies leave Ukraine. Actually, we have several couples who have settled down in Ukraine. Gentlemen love it here so much that they have left their countries and they have decided to settle down in Ukraine. So no, it was never the reason. We do international dating because we believe that love has no borders. We believe that international couples have so much more fun. And uh, do we hate Ukrainian guys? No, we love them dearly. We love all gentlemen from all around the world. If they are true gentlemen, if they treat their ladies right, if they are romantic, if they are chivalrous, uh, if they are traditional, uh, then we love them dearly. Guys, I hope I have answered your question. I wish everybody love and romance. With love, Svetlana Mucha from Diole.com.